Hey everyone, Daniel for Twin Bytes with another tutorial for you. This time I'm going to explain the difference between cold booting and warm booting your computer, what the difference is and why you might want to do that. First off, to understand cold boot versus warm boot. Cold boot is also known as hard booting and it's really just turning your computer off and turning it back on again. Or if it's already shut off, you're just powering it on. It's cold booting when you turn it on first thing in the morning. Warm booting is when the computer's already on and you just go to the start menu and hit restart. And it just closes everything down gracefully and starts it back up again. Understanding the difference between what they do, a warm boot will restart services that you have and it'll close stuck processes or programs. The cold boot will actually do everything that a warm boot does, but in addition to that, it resets drivers because they're hardware related and cold booting is to do with hardware. And it flushes out the memory completely to make sure that anything that was stuck in there, uh, it won't load right back up again when it reboots. And it does a post or power on self test, which is the most important thing for the cold boot is testing the hardware to make sure that everything's working properly. So to know the difference when you want a cold boot versus warm boot, if you're having any kind of hardware problems, turn the computer right off and do the cold boot. It does take longer because of the power on self test. Otherwise a warm boot is good for software problems and it is a lot quicker to get it up and running again. Now you know what to do the next time you're having a computer problem, if you can get away with a quick reboot or if you have to actually turn the computer right off and turn it back on again. And if you found this video helpful, please do give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye for now.